This is Fresh Tings Assembly Language, written by Xander Obzert. Beaudrillard, 2nd of April 2009 to current day. It's under construction. We have exam assembly language tables here. Look at, look at that. These give you the ASCII control characters. Alt key combinations, keyboard scan codes, it's all here. Function keys, other function keys, as you control characters. Then you've got M Microsoft ASM Assembler Download. This is the actual program with debugger, ML, MSN and Link. There's all the source stuff there, then you've got source code download, all the source code, and also a Vasella Trojan here. For Linux, that is the Vasella Trojan, but the site is mostly about Windows programming, assembly language. Here you can see the assembly language tutorial that I am writing. It has using the assembly the introduction using the assembly library procedures and interrupts video page swapping example conditional jumps integer arithmetic structures and macros numeric conversions and libraries strings and arrays disk storage file processing high level language interfacing and two advanced topics as you can see you got the introduction a hello world hello world program there it's, that's as simple as it gets. It, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven lines of code. And it outputs hello world. Seven lines of code to output something. Isn't that fantastic? That's 32 bit assembler for you. Then you've got an explanation of the program there. Then you've got more source code. This one times for that Irving library. How to interface with an external library. And this has got all library commands in there. Then you're going down to this one. Then this one tells you how to do subroutines. This is a subroutine there, how to call a subroutine. Then this part here is the graphics. Start and now there is more graphics applications in the source code. But this is a um, video page swapping example. It switches between page one and two. This one is conditional jumps to read a direct program flow. It tests for an alphabetic input this is a really good program it is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 lines long 14 15 16 17 18, 18 lines long and it's got um, an encryption program it's an encryption program isn't that fantastic told you how to use it here encrypt plain text coded encrypt coded plain text that's the decryption part then you've got display ASCII binary program this displays the binary of ASCII then you've got student structure demonstration this is um, a struct how to use a struct then you've got this one here um, this um, that's it and I've still got to do numeric conversions and libraries, strings and arrays, disk storage, file processing, high level language interfacing and the advanced topics. But that's where I'm getting to so far. Now we've also got on here um, 40 hex virus writing zine issue 1 the tiny virus. Now this is um, an actual virus source code, what you can compile with um, what you can compile with um, MSAM, Microsoft Assembler, for download on the site. So you can compile this tiny virus and infect your friends command.com. This is it, it's all there. I think it works, I've never tested it myself, I don't want to test it, I'm not really into viruses, but I included it just in case you someone wanted to learn how to write a virus. 
that is the basic starting block it's the tiny virus or the 163 com virus the tiny 163 virus or the kennedy 163 visual status is rare discovery is june 1990 symptoms command com and com files growth origins is denmark the efficient length is 163 bytes parasitic non-resident com infected detection method virus scan virex pcf prot nav ibm scan scan df prot or delete infected files but that is basically my site right there you've also got how to create a dynamic limp library with visual studio 2005 c++ tutorials and visual basic net tutorials well i've yet to get to them but that is just parts what i have done written by xander obzit but with that and that's what I'm saying, man. You can enjoy this stuff. Enjoy it.